Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Daniel is in the house, okay? Today, I'm going to teach you how to make vegan vegan um um what should I call it? Meat. Just vegan meat. Vegan meat. So to, that's that's what I'm gonna be doing today. So let's go ahead and let's get started. Hello everybody and welcome to Cooking with Daniel Part 2. Now I know that the first part was me making Oreos. I didn't show the full cooking. So I'm going to and last time I cooked on my stove in my kitchen. And I knew I had a skillet somewhere. So here's my skillet. And I'm going to be cooking on this skillet right here. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to make vegan meat with vegetables in it. That's it. So let's start off by turning on the skillet. Yes. You have to turn on the skillet. How do I do this? Thank you. And then you have to plug this piece into an outlet, which is what I have. And my ring light cut off. Uh, ring light, don't do this. Ring light, it took me two minutes to turn you on because you wouldn't turn on. Ring light, don't do this. Thank Ring light, ring light, don't do this. Ring light, ring light. Thank you, ring light. Oh. Oh, this is on. Oh, that's, oh. Because I squatted back down. I'm like, why is hot? Because <laughs> it is. Okay, so you want to turn this to three. Oh, shoot. That's the 5,000. Any th oh, this is getting hot. How am I going to cook like this? <sighs> if you didn't notice, I'm squatting right now. But what we're going to do is we're going to cook on this skillet. Now, this is getting hot. So, um, let me actually go get the ingredients first. And spread it. You want to take the water and spread it. Yes. The reason why I put water on here is so that the grill does not burn. And I forgot an ingredient. So once, well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're gonna, wrong cup. We're going to add some vegetable oil. Now you can add avocado oil. I don't know what that is. So we're gonna add some vegetable oil. Now you may be saying like vegetable cooking oil, yes. What you fry your chicken in, what you do other stuff too, pork chop, whatever. But instead I'm gonna use the spray, as you can see. I'm gonna use the spray only because this is a skillet. And with when you're trying to eat healthy, you don't wanna use too much like oils and stuff because they're still bad for you. That's why they use avocado oil because it's healthier. But when you use vegetable oil and stuff like that, I use spray so it's not too much. So let me back up. Oh, okay. So, just spray it. Hold on, is this cooking? As you can see in this bowl, I have my veggie patty. This is an impossible veggie patty. I got it from Sam's Club. And I have my veg vegetables. Hopefully you can hear me. Okay, why does it keep falling in here? Don't fall. Well, actually, never mind, because it's going to go to waste. What you want to do is you want to make space. In the center, so create a circle. Take your veggie patty, which has probably not thawed out yet, but it doesn't matter. Take it and put it right there. And you want to cook this veggie patty. What I also like to do, which is probably not healthy, which well, I'm get it, it probably is because it's vegetable oil. It, it's healthy. Okay, it's healthy today. It's gonna be healthy today. I like to take some cooking spray and just spray it just a little bit just a little bit a little bit so you want to let this cook okay you want to let this cook now you do want to move your vegetables around so that they don't burn only because your vegan burger is going to take a little bit of time to cook hold on where is my ipad where is my ipad where is my, where is, where is it? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh. 
So you want to flip your vegan burger. You want to flip. You want to flip. You don't want to flip? Flip. So once you flip it, it should be looking good and tasteful like this is. Now, let me bring the camera close so you can see. So when your vegan burger looks like this, you know, your vegetables, you have all your vegetables and stuff like this. When your vegan burger is like kind of cooked a little bit, you want to, you want to, never mind, it's still frozen. So when your vegan burger is soft like this is, okay, I'm going to move the vegetables so you can see. Move, move, move. Take it and stab it. Just imagine if somebody you don't like and just, you know, just, just, you know, imagine if somebody you don't like. I got a good vision of who that is. So when your vegan burger is chopped up into almost like hamburger meat is when you're cooking it and you like chop it up, that's how this is. But instead it's vegan meat. You want to take your vegetables and you want to take your vegan meat and you want to chop it all up. And When you're in this stage, what you want to do now you want to take your seasonings. Now, this is ghetto. This is the ghetto kitchen, so we put it all in one cup. So, in this cup, I have a little bit of garlic, a little bit of seasoning salt. Let me, let me, hold on. Let me make it professional. Hold on. Let me, let me drink some water. You want to take one teaspoon of garlic, one and a half teaspoons of seasoning, complete seasoning, one teaspoon of orange pepper seasoning. One teaspoon. Did I say teaspoon? I meant tablespoon. For everything I just said, I meant tablespoon. You want to take one tablespoon of garlic. One tablespoon of complete seasoning. One tablespoon of one and a half tablespoon of orange pepper. So now. Once you've seasoned your food, then you may be like, this is bad, but this is not bad. You want to take a little bit and spray a little coating, like so, a vegetable oil, so that the the, bur the burger can suck up all the nutrients and stuff. You see, I told you I don't know what I'm talking about. Y'all need to have to do that. I don't know what I'm talking about. This is about done because this ain't done. So what you want to do is you want to take this and kind of like spread it out so that it can evenly cook. You know what I'm saying? You know? Because the vegan meat is not supposed to look like this. It's supposed to be cooked. Before I was rudely interrupted, this is not finished. So, you want to spread it out. This is done because this is gonna burn. So what you wanna do is you wanna turn your, 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 either your oven, your stove, well not your oven, your stove, your your skillet or your hot plate whatever you're using i'm using a big skillet and you want to turn it to off and then as the the skillet heat decreases this is going to cook a little bit more so i'll be back when this is completely finished and there we go as you can see this is finished okay Hopefully you guys enjoyed this little video I tried to do. Um, I will see y'all in the next video that I do. Have a great day. Bye.